Hey guys, it's Gabby. Did you know that Mr. Snuffleupagus from Sesame Street wasn't real for the first 17 seasons? In the beginning, he was Big Bird's imaginary friend and only he could see him. Then, in 1985, the producers decided to end the long-running gag and premiered an episode where the whole cast finally met Snuffy, proving he wasn't imaginary. Steven Spielberg produced 65 episodes of Pinky and the Brain. Maurice Sendak, the author of Where the Wild Things Are, originally intended to write a book called Where the Wild Horses Are. He later realized that he could not and would never be able to draw horses, so he changed the whole theme of the book. In the same way that you can check out books from a library, some libraries allow you to check out plant seeds. Instead of the normal two weeks to check out a book, you have until harvest to replenish the seeds that you checked out from the library. Carl Sagan, a world-renowned astrophysicist, considered Back to the Future 2 to be the greatest time travel movie ever made. He believed that above any other time travel movie, Back to the Future 2 was extremely accurate in handling the multiple timelines. There's a drug that has an extremely interesting side effect in 5% of its patients. Clomipramine, which is used to treat depression, can cause patients to get an orgasm every time they yawn. This is known as the yawngasm effect. I'm not making this up. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Let us know in the comments. If the DeLorean was just parked in your garage, what would be the first thing you'd do? Oh hey, before we go, I wanted to show you guys our very first game. With our partners at Mind Mayhem, we created the OMG Facts Puzzle Game. It's a really fun new game that combines the traditional crossword with a word search and OMG Facts. I've been playing the iPad version and it's tons of fun. Click the link on the description bar below to get it now.